Bonjour. Bonjour. <laughs> no. Time for bladder check. Check. So it's a show? It's a lifestyle. It's a religion. <laughs> My emotions! My emotions! I'm still French. Ouais, c'est pas faux. I'm a woman, Mary. I can be as contrary as I choose. Non, moi je crois qu'il faut que vous arrêtiez d'essayer de dire des trucs. Hello, hi, I'm Noah. I'm gonna watch The Last of Us Season 1, Episode 6. I'm not sure that the camera is okay. Wait a minute. It seems okay, at least it's gonna be enough. <laughs> I was saying that I'm gonna watch The Last of Us Season 1, Episode 6. If you want to see my reaction videos about the first episodes of this Season 1, I'm gonna put the links, you know, for the playlist that I made for The Last of Us. I made one playlist for each show, each anime that I'm reacting to, so you can find, you know, the videos into the chronological order. And I'm gonna put some links, you know, for the previous episodes. I'm gonna make my homework, like always. I was saying, I'm gonna watch this episode 6 of The Last of Us. You know, I discussed about it with some of you guys on my Patreon, you know, during the last live session that we made together. About The Last of Us, it's really a rhythm of one big episode, one long episode, one short episode, and during the big episode, we are discovering new characters and we are saying goodbye to these characters during the same episode. And we have one shorter episode with a lot of actions, with a lot of stuff, you know, happening during it. But it's really just more for the story to make it move a little quicker. For this episode, normally, it should be a shorter episode. And I saw that, in fact, it was a long one, almost one hour. So I hope that it's gonna be the episode that I'm waiting for since almost the beginning, meaning one episode for the main characters. Because since the beginning, in fact, we didn't have an episode like that. <laughs> I don't know if you saw that. Since the beginning, in fact, all of the long episodes were for the non-player characters of this game to present us these new characters, to introduce them to our main characters, Joel and Ellie, to understand their backgrounds, what they want right now, you know, what is happening with them, to discover really more about them and to have the time to connect with them these non-player characters, these new characters, so at the end, we're gonna say goodbye to them, and in fact, they're gonna die, and in fact, they were gonna cry for them like hell. But the main characters, really, truly, Ellie and Joel, I said it like, with the episodes and spending time with them, I got attached to them, and in fact, I got attached more to their relationship because we saw their relationship evolving with time. But themselves, you know, their characters for who they are, for what they want, for their backgrounds, for their attitudes and all. A little okay, but not that much. In fact, it's really more their relationship that I appreciate because we saw that little by little. They care about each other, they protect each other, they are there for each other, so it's cool. But themselves, I want an episode only for them, for these main characters, to spend time only with them, to have these two discussing about their lives, about what happened to them. And we have secrets, you know, around them. Meaning that for Ellie, I want to discover what happened into the mall. My theory is the fact that she was not all alone into that mall. She was with someone that she loved. A girl, a boy, I don't know. But someone that she loved and maybe that person got beaten also and died. Something like that. But I want the confirmation of it and I want for Ellie to say it no matter what. And for Joel, you can be like, we discovered what happened to him, you know, that he has a daughter, that he lost her. Okay, we know that, but Ellie, she doesn't know it, so I want him to say it. And I think that saying it, we're gonna discover that he's, he's still traumatized about that. And still, we need stuff to discover what happened to him during all of this time, you know, all of the gap that we had during the, the episode one, you know, what happened really, truly to him. 
and the fact that he was a former soldier so I think that we have also stuff about it into his past you know stuff to, to understand to discover so really for me we need one entire episode only for the characters meaning not a long episode for the non-player characters to meet one to say goodbye to one not a short episode for the action you know for a lot of things happening into it really a long episode for them for these two to discuss for these two to discover more about them maybe through memories like i wouldn't be mad you know to have some memories with them you know I'm thinking about how an episode can be built, maybe it can be like that, you know, like the first part of an episode being only about flashbacks and the second part being about them discussing about these flashbacks. I don't know how they can do that, but I want that at some point and the fact that this episode is a long episode and normally it's not gonna be an episode for non-player characters, for new characters, Maybe it's gonna be during this one that I'm gonna have what I just said and what I want since a long time now. Because I need to connect more with these characters. I said it so far, I connected with their relationship because we saw it, you know, beginning and evolving. But then, truly, these characters, maybe I connected more with Ellie because she's such an open character, you know, like she wants to make some jokes and she's funny she's connecting really quickly with the new people that they are meeting you know maybe it's easier to connect with her than with joel so i want that i truly want that i hope that it's gonna happen during this episode if not are we gonna discover a new character and that character is gonna die during this episode like really during the last episode I was like I learned my lesson with the last of us okay I'm gonna get attached to to Henry and Sam but I'm not gonna cry when they're gonna die because for sure they're gonna die and really they made me think that maybe maybe they wouldn't die like for some minutes I believed that they wouldn't die because truly if you saw my reaction video about it you saw that during all of the episode I was like you're gonna die you're so gonna die like i don't know how but you're gonna die i even predicted you know the fact that one of them would be beaten during all of these things you know it was so messy i was like that's it we didn't see it but one of you that's it and really during some minutes i was like no truly everyone is okay really you're gonna join joel Ellie? really but they make me think that it could be uh, it could happen they made me have up and in fact uh, not at all so that's it now i know my lesson i can get attached to them but they're gonna die so i need to prepare myself to not cry that much at the end when it's gonna happen i can't cry like that at the end when i already know the end you know i can be like ha i said it but i can't be like oh, i said it <laughs> you know no, that's it. You're not gonna have me again. Episode 6, we have 9 episodes. I think if I remember it correctly for this season. So we are close to the end, in fact. At least we are already into the second part of this season. So I'm thinking, you know, about the game. I didn't play to the game, but I know how games like that are supposed to be made. It means that the risk of the action needs to accelerate a little at least we need to find more clues more stuff you know Ellie, the fact that she can be a medicine and all like we need to to progress with that also during this episode normally oh the sun mm, i don't know if i'm gonna keep things like that you know it's gonna depend on how much i can see the screen or not I'm sorry in advance if during the video the lights are changing and stuff like that. I, I can't change the weather and I don't have a professional studio. I don't have any ring lights and stuff like that. I have really just a little room and uh, really cheap like it's not gonna help me right there. So I'm sorry for that. If you want to help me to have more stuff you know to film these videos 
you have my Patreon and on my Patreon you can have these episodes of The Last of Us one day sooner and with an extended or full reaction part. So far I put only extended reaction part for The Last of Us but you know the extended reaction part because it's long episodes it's almost like 20 minutes longer for the long episodes so if you want this episode in advance and with a longer reaction part you have my Patreon if you want to help me also to fight this you know the sun, the light being forced to change things and all if you want to support me you know you have my Patreon for that and if you can't you know I totally understand that and you can still support me right now on YouTube by liking, subscribing, sharing, commenting that kind of stuff that's it I can't see you anymore That's it! The light changed and it's gonna change again. Uh, yes, if you want to have a Patreon, and that's it! I said everything that I wanted to say during this intro. Let's go for this episode! Oh! And also on my Patreon, you don't have the logo on the screen. You know that I'm forced to put it for YouTube. It's not what I like to, to do, but for HBO stuff, I'm forced to do it like that. Don't blame me, blame HBO for that. Like, you know, for shows like Game of Thrones and stuff like that, they were playing fair with the reactors who were playing fair, who were respecting the fair use rules. And since more than one year now, they are total assaults with that and really they don't care about fair use rules or about reactors and stuff like that. Like, they don't want to play fair, they don't want to to accept fair use rules or anything, they are just blocking and blocking and blocking the videos. I really don't know why, or maybe they need more money. I don't know if their numbers are not okay during this years, maybe during the last years. Like really to annoy people for 10 cents, you're really that desperate HBO. Or... I don't want to see it again. Why are we seeing it again? Your enfant. Three months? Oui. It's taking you that long to find your brother? We're somewhere here. Exactly where? And your answer would be the same as your wife's. You are lost? Once past the river. Death. We never see who's out there, but we see the bodies they leave behind. You're not gonna scare us. You scared him? Mm. <laughs> It's his brother. Joe, leave it, okay? Joe, should we die? Are you okay? No, but are you? He was just reminded that you're dead, I'm fucked. It's not fine. No, 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 no. It was a panic attack or something like that. Oh, yeah. Let's say we find the fireflies, it all works. They draw my blood and put it through some of their fancy machines and make a cure. That's the best option. It It's a lot of if you know to go there. Okay, fine, whatever you. Maybe an old farmhouse, some land, a ranch. Cool. Yes, yeah, cool. I'll raise sheep. They're quiet. Do what they're told. Yeah, yeah, okay. Romantic. <laughs> Simple. It'll work, right? Vaccine. You need to find people I tried. smart Same. enough to create it sure. and use with it. the good tools and all. And rub some of my blood into his fight. I know, I know, it's stupid, but I wanted to save him. You tried. Still mumbling in your sleep. I woke up early. You were passed out, so I took a second off. You need to sleep also, you know? I was quiet. I checked my six. I looked for tracks. I found the high ground. I kept watch. 
Thank you, Tom, too. Good girl. It almost looked like a thank you or a well done. Your head doing that. Remember that. Don't people. Fine. Yes, yes, the picture is good. Amazing. with the fingers. I know without, you know. But with? You should teach me how to hunt. Hey, Joel, what if this is the river of death? This one? Too late! Too late, too late, too late. You're gonna test them? With the dog? She's okay, she's okay. She's she's okay now, maybe he's not gonna smell anything. <laughs> cool. And he was really scared for her. An entire town. It's cool. Looks great. Come in! To see you smile, to see you last. Marina and his family, actually. Oh, oh. shit! Congrats! Yes! John, say congrats. Your manners. Congrats. We settled here about seven years ago. Just a handful of us back then. That section was already a gated community, so we built the rest of the wall out from there. Is that infected? Yeah, but usually smaller colonies. Wandered off from the city. All this open country out here? It's a turkey shoot. Can't shot those fuckers from a half mile out. Can you teach me how? No, we can't. How do you keep this place quiet? Carefully. Being in the middle of nowhere help, staying off the radio. House and worship? multi faith School? I wouldn't be scared, you know, of the infected for them, but for other people, humans. <laughs> and you have some ships. That much. So how's Tess? She's fine. All right. Good then. She's the daughter of some firefly muppy mup. She's trying to find her family somewhere out here. I was heading in this direction, so... Yeah. Oh really? You're not seeing the truth yes, about anything. So you know where they might be? These fireflies? You know, they got a base down at the University of Eastern Colorado. It's uh, a week's ride south. It's severely fucked up between here and there. If 
Il doit être en tout cas, to lead in that place. Why? Because your wife won't let you. You know, she didn't want to kick you off the radio. Is that why you stopped messaging me back? After I ditched the fireflies, Marie and her crew found me. And all they ask is that I follow their rules. I'm your brother. Yeah, I'm aware. They're very protective of this place. If a good fucking reason, wrong people might show up. Mm -hmm. So is that what I am? Am I the wrong people? So no, but it would have put them in danger. He did those things. They weren't famous. We murdered people. And I don't judge you for it. We just you did bad stuff. Tess, she said it. I've been through Tommy trying to find you these last few months. I'm going to be a father. I thought about it, you know, the fact that you can't leave. So I just gotta be more careful. <laughs> Say congrats. But I don't know how. I feel like I'd be a good dad. Why not? You want to be present for your kid? That's already good enough. I guess we'll find out. That's all you got? Just because life stopped for you? Doesn't mean it has to stop for me. We'll grab some supplies and be out of your hair in the morning. Don't be like that. Oh, Joel. Your ego. I'm sure that he knows his brother's reasons and he can understand them, but clearly he doesn't want to understand them, you know? <laughs> New crisis.